Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today we're going to take a look at a very cool 1971 Dodge Charger. This is a true WS Code RT and it is also a factory uh, Y3 Curious Yellow High Impact car. Uh, great car, good solid body. Uh, I actually took this car in on trade uh, from a buddy of ours out of North Carolina. Uh, good car. Uh, I'll tell you what, the car runs and drives excellent. He just spent $5,000 having the motor gone through. So it's got a freshly rebuilt motor with less than 500 miles on it. There is a receipt for that in the trunk. Uh, 727 Torque Flight Automatic Trans, 8 and 3 quarter, 355 Sure Grip Rear. Good car. Like I say, factory RT, factory color combo. Uh, it's got a good look to it. I like the I like the Chargers. In 71, I like the Chargers. This car's got the air grabber hood. It's not factory, uh, but it does have the air, grab, uh, air grabber on it now. Uh, BF Goodrich radial TAs all the way around it with a 15-inch uh, radio or um, uh, rallies. Good car. Like I said, if you're looking for a nice driver, that's what this car is. Uh, you can kind of nitpick some of the stuff in the paint. Um, there's definitely some of the, some stuff in this car that you can kind of nitpick, um, but a nice car, good driver quality car. Pretty paint. I like the curious yellow. Of course, I love that air grabber hood. We think the switch, uh, it, it uh, the uh, uh, we think the uh, switch in the in the dash there has gone bad. We're gonna try to get another one. Um, right now, it's just propped open. It stays open. Vinyl tops in great shape. Got the going on the rear. Car is nice and flat down the sides. Gonna sits good. Uh, it's got a little bit taller BFG on there, so it's got that factory style look on. It's got the uh, machine gun tips. That's a pretty cool option on these cars. The bumperettes. Again, as you can kind of see some touch-up marks, there's a few, like I say, as you walk around this car, you can definitely nitpick it. But a good car, good straight driver, guys. That's what the car is. I love the gills on the side of these cars. I think they're so cool. Uh, it's an air correct uh, 71 72 440 block again freshly rebuilt there's a receipt in the trunk for the for the engine uh, that was just done Edelbrock four barrel we and intake it's got a set of headers on it uh, power steering um, it's got uh, Mopar performance valve covers they have upgraded it as well to uh, electronic ignition 727 torque flight automatic trans Again, it's got the air grabber hood. Like I say, Jay thinks it's the in the switch and the actual switch to actually that's going to need to to make it function. Hits the road good. I've driven it a couple of times. It's nice and tight. Um, plenty of power. Car scoots down the road, I'll tell you that. Uh, it's got the dual chrome mirror option. This is a remote mirror. Yeah, it's got the original door handles on it. Uh, original door tags still in the door. Factory black vinyl interior. Oh, 
bucket seats, council. It's got the tough wheel, uh, factory tack engages. The tack isn't working. Um, I think everything else in the dash is working. 59,000 original miles. It's got the factory AM FM. Uh, I know the blower motor works. It's getting its dual exhaust with the machine gun tips. Eight and three quarter, uh, three five five uh, sure grip rear end. It's got the factory jack with spare in here in the trunk. Uh, here, like I say, here's the receipt. You can see fifty six hundred eighty nine dollars. He just spent having the motor gone through. It's all body color in here. Um, looks like it's got all the original insulation, so I'd say it's got the original quarters on it. I know the owner's manuals are in the glove box. We got it up in the air, got some good pictures of the underbody for you. My camera to focus here. The sun's directly behind us, coming over my shoulder. Again, we got it up in the air. Got some good pictures of the underside for you. Bunch of new stuff coming, guys. If you're watching the site, I'm kind of popping singular pictures of cars as they're kind of sneaking in here. As you know, I like to shoot my own videos and everything of the cars. Um, but if you want, you can call the boys up. They'll snag you some photos. Um, other stuff that's because there's actually about four or five cars that are actually here that are got sneak peeks on them if you look at the ad but if you call like I say if you call the guys dash is nice in this car too um, they can get you more photos like I said I just like to do all the ads myself dual chrome mirrors that's pretty cool Really hits the road good. Nice driver. Good looking front end on these cars. Yeah, I love the side gills. They look like a great white shark to me. Again, all your, the only thing that's not working is that tack. We'll kind of take a peek at it, see if we can get it to work. But all your other gauges are working. I know the blower motor works. Uh, it's got the inside hood release. It's got a great sound. Like I say, you want a nice driver? I think you'll have a blast with this car. It hits the road good. I didn't get anything on the radio. It's factory AM, FM. Like I say, I know the blower motor works. Wipers. It needs a transmission arm, Jay, did you say? Yeah. yeah. The, wiper is missing, the wipers are missing a transmission arm. We'll try to we'll call John over at Roadsville Chrysler, see if we can locate one of those. Make sure, you keep, make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our Facebook page or our Instagram page. Or as always, guys, pick up the phone. Give us a call, 248-620-3355. That car's got a good look to it. Have a great day, guys.